log cabin update uh, I've installed a storm door and may paint it to a gray or a brown uh, something more matching so it took me about a day to cut out these uh, jams with a chisel very difficult to do uh, the door instructions called for one inch uh, all the way around square plumbing true so I went to work with the chisels and cut that out uh, difficult very difficult and as with everything I've done with this cabin my mistakes followed me all the way to the peak of the roof uh, should have thought this out a little more but first log cabin build As you can see my chisel marks up and down through there Let's see how she closes. <coughs> Pretty nice, close enough for real work, as I like to say. So, uh, the chinkin's coming right along. I, finished the interior today uh, right here in this corner you see the, the dark mortar that's that was just done today so and then we went to the outside and if you don't do this stuff for a while you lose uh, the knack for it and you have to get back in the groove your learning curve has to come back let's go look outside for a minute so knowing that, I decided to start on the corner where it's not really visible. You see the darker mortar right here where we started. It's a really tight place to work. And this, this log here is charred in case you're wondering. Working our way up and then a, a big glob right here. So. It doesn't turn out so well. I'll bust it out with a hammer and start over. Uh, this is our log tongue and groove. So we'll be uh, filling that in and uh, finishing up the exterior. So there's your update. Uh, thank you for watching.